And they're off for the MBNA Chester Vars of 2016 and Port Douglas from stall one, pushed forward by Shami Heffernan and adopts the front running role here, moving on by a length and a half to the keen going Dwight D, disputing second with US Army Ranger Moore, dark blue silks. And then biodynamic orange cap, high grounds, just not settling through the first couple of furlongs, needs a bit of cover. He's just allowed to drift back through the field by Daryl Holland, but he's throwing his head around and wants to go a fair bit quicker at present high grounds. And Olmito is last to the field as they turn on in and with a quarter of a mile now behind them. So Port Douglas leading them down the straight, a little over a length and a half clear. Two stable mates and anti-post derby favourite US Army Ranger. And then the keen going biodynamic in third with Dwight D reined back into fourth place in the hands of Jamie Spencer. High grounds is last but one and a half length further away or Mito. Circuit of the Rudy in front of them then in the chest of Ars and Port Douglas leads into the next turn. His stable companion slipstreaming him, US Army Ranger from Biodynamic and Dwight D close up in fourth and then high grounds and Ormito. Along the viaduct side of the course, they pass the seven. Jamie Heffernan glances in behind on Port Douglas. He'll observe that he has a lead now of three lengths over Ryan Moore on US Army Ranger. Biodynamic and Dougie Costello, orange cap still sitting close up. Jamie Spencer, yellow jacket, Dwight D in fourth. A further half length, high grounds and Daryl Holland, the stripes of green and black and Ormito and David Probert at the back of the field. They're past halfway, on now towards the final five furlongs. And Port Douglas still dictating terms. More and US Army Rangers slipstreaming, Biodynamic Dwight D. High Grounds is out wide and Ormito back on the inside. They leave the half mile behind them now and the pace just beginning to lift a little as both High Grounds and Biodynamic move up to the quarters of Port Douglas. And one or two jostling for a position there and Dwight D was pushed out wide and now more just begins to shake the reins ever so gently on US Army Ranger just to keep up tabs on Port Douglas who's up the ante with two and a half furlongs to travel. Port Douglas by a length and a half to US Army Ranger, shadowed by high grounds. Then Biodynamic Dwight D and Ormito. They round the final part of the turn inside the two. Port Douglas with US Army Ranger now out after him and the O'Brien pair of quick and three lengths clear of Biodynamic. Down the straight, US Army Ranger comes to Port Douglas. They pass the furlong. Moore crouching low on US Army Ranger. And just now inching away from Port Douglas who digs in gamely under pressure. And O'Brien one two as they race close home. US Army Army Ranger doing enough inches home to win the Vars in a 1-2 for Aidan O'Brien. He beats Port Douglas and it's a record-breaking success for the Valley Doll handler in the chest of Vars. Ormito was riding behind with Biodynamic.